flashback. It has been confirmed to me that I am blocked from Ranger Stop Atlanta. If you don't know who I am, I am him resilient. Um, you volunteered at Ranger Stop and you've I, always volunteered at Ranger Stop. How many years in a row? I, I've been a volunteer for every single Ranger Stop in Orlando as well as in Atlanta, except for Orlando year one and year seven. Okay. And you're on Henry Court, correct? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, what's your name on Henry Court? Right there, Joey Renault. Oh, there's right. no you say what? There's just no space. Okay. All right. Cool. 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 How long have you been on Henry Court? Um, for about a day or so since you sent me the link. Oh, since I sent you the link. <laughs> okay. Okay. I didn't know it was there. So. All right. All right. All right. Um, quick question. Uh, so what did you want to tell us about Ranger Stop? Um, I, I mean, I don't think there was anything specifically that I wanted to say about Ranger Stop. I just thought that if there were, um, some behind, um, some, some, I don't know, questions or viewpoints that you may have that you might want to discuss uh, by having an actual employee from Ranger Stop. Well, I'm not an employee. I'm a volunteer. Um, that sort of thing. OK, yeah, I do. I do see you just joined June 30th. Welcome to have you poked around in Ranger Court? I have. It was really neat to actually see a whole bunch of people talking about Ranger Stop at uh, Ranger Stuff. OK. Yeah. All right. Um, let's go back to me being banned. You said you wanted to make sure I didn't attend it. Is that correct? I not. I, did, I, did, I wanted to, <laughs> I just wanted to make sure in my mind I did. I didn't want you to be like, oh, yeah, I was there. I'm, I didn't want to repeat myself. Something okay. that you may not know. That's all right. So um, were, were you aware that I was banned? No, I was not aware. OK. I, wow. So I worked admissions. I was the one who like, and anyone who was given those free uh, weekend vouchers, I was the one that they gave those to when I gave them their weekend passes. Literally the first person like anyone would see. I would like to, th and, and when you say that you're banned, it, it makes me feel like, shouldn't we have all seen a list of people that should not be able to buy a ticket if they come up in person to try and buy them? Okay. There was nothing. There was nothing like that at all. And I was right in front of security. And it's not like I mean, security. Yes, there was a police officer. There were a few other police officers, but the people who were vetting the lines were just normal volunteers. Okay. Was, well, so so I could have just I could have walked up and just bought a ticket. More than likely. Like I mean, I'm sure many people would recognize your face. So that would make it. <laughs> okay. I wouldn't recognize your face though. All right. So this <laughs> you might have been able to get in, and then it would have been oh. Dude, look at you. <laughs> All right. So you wouldn't have known. Have, have you watched my content long or? I've watched your content for about a, a couple weeks now. Okay. All right. And I see you got the blue ranger hat on. Are you a David Yost fan? I'm, I'm, I, you asked the question earlier and I, I said B, but like just the color. I, David Yost was the first person that I was a handler for and I had never been a handler before. Um, it was Ranger Stop year two. And I don't know what happened to his handler, but I was just like a backup person. Okay. Like, I used to go to like Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks and get all the Rangers coffee. And I would buy them all for a, like, they'd be like, oh, here's money. I'm like, nah, you got big sister, big brother privilege. Sorry. Like, that's just how it is. Um, so, okay. so did you ever see like David Yost handle, have a bad interaction? Like kind of what Brent is explaining? The blue ranger, Billy was my favorite ranger. So you can imagine like the goosebumps, like my little inner kid still gets them thinking that I got to have that one-on-one -on -one interaction side by side, sitting, doing business. Like it was cool. I had never done it before okay. and I did not do it the way that he wanted to have it done he was very um poignant to me at one point and i i i had asked to be replaced i i didn't want to sit next to him any anymore what it, it hurt 
no, because like Walter Jones was on the other side of me. Like at one point, like he shook my hand and he would not let go. And the smile on that fucker's face was like, uh huh. Hi, how you doing? Uh huh. It just, dude, I, me and Walter are cool. I've met him a few times. Okay. After. Well, but, Joey. Uh, yeah. Uh, this is, this is very interesting that you decided to say you wanted to come on my show because I did receive some information and your name came up. Nice. And they said I was banned specifically because you showed a message to security about me wanting people to call out Austin St. John. Could you speak to that? Um, nobody has let me know that anyone has been banned, especially because of anything that I did. I... I know that I did let security know that there is a possibility of a whole bunch of people wanting to go and boo Austin St. John away. I don't know how that would work. So you show them pictures of the Discord to corroborate the booing? Correct. So it is, you are the guy. I mean, I, I am the guy. I didn't know anyone got banned over it. The messages that I showed didn't explicitly show that any specific person was involved. Now, this is interesting, Joey, because I'm looking at uh, Henry Court and I see you just joined today. Yeah. Oh, was it? Okay. I thought it was last night. So you I, must I, have you sent, me, so, sent me the email. So you joined and unjoined because the only way you could see that is if you joined. I didn't unjoin. So you joined previously to show the message of the booing. No. So how did no, you get those were sent to me? Those were sent to me. Those came from your Discord. I don't even know where they came from. Oh, they who, were sent to me. Who sent them to you? Um, somebody who lives on the other side of the world. So they sent them to you and said, "What was the context?" Um, just hey, thought you might want to be aware of this, and I'm like, it doesn't matter what anyone's opinion of any ranger is. You can't intentionally try to throw disdain at a convention that we're all there to have a good time. And that's not something that should happen. So okay. I did I did the right thing and I showed this to the owners, Mikey. Okay, so you showed them to the owners that people may potentially be booing uh, Austin St. John. So we need to make sure that the people around his area are watched. That's all. And they didn't ever tell you that because you showed them those messages that I was permanently banned because you no. got them from now on those messages. Was it me telling people to boo Austin St. John? Nope. It was. Um, I mean, I can pull them up. Can you send them to me on Inst- on, on Henry Court? Yeah. Can you DM them? Let me, uh, yeah, I can do that. Let me add you as a friend real quick. Cause we've been trying to figure out what was the messages, but, um, Mm -hmm. we appreciate your honesty. Absolutely. I have nothing to hide. Like I am not going to say anything negative about anyone. I'm not going to say anything specifically positive about anyone. I'm neutral. Like, this is what I love to do. Uh, this is, it looks like you cut off the person who said, I still, th- the, I think the plan is still in uh, place. That's for what it. I got. That's what I got. That was what I received. Okay. Hold on. Out of that. Okay. Um, give me a second. Uh, I still think the plan, boo him out of Ranger Stop and Pop. Okay. Give me one second because we have a search feature. Boo him out of, um, I think they may have deleted it. Okay, so now (laughs) y'all want to see why I got banned? I think y'all do. I think there is general interest in why I got banned. And this was no fault of Joey's guys. I don't I don't I don't blame Joey for this. Uh, And I don't blame you another one. Okay. Those Uh, are the only two that I have. (laughs) Oh, fucking. All right. So. We will, we will, we will open these. Give me a second, guys. So for the people who want to know why I was banned. <laughs> and that didn't, and the, I didn't even show that until like the day of the con. Yeah, I got so, banned day of the con. They told me day of, well, 
no one told me day of. No, nothing, nothing of that even like shows you. I know, Javi. I mean, I know, Joey. I know, Joey. I'm not mad at you. We really appreciate your honesty. And because you were honest and forthcoming. We were, we were meant to speak. I I thought it was odd because we thought the army, the resilient army there. I knew about your name and I intentionally did not release it because I didn't want people to come after you. OK, that's okay. that was my. All right. Look, guys. All right. So. For our, if you guys are ready to see why I was banned, you can see it live with Joey and he can show you this. OK, here it goes. All right. Uh, I think the plan is still for fans to boo. <laughs> you can't see it. Boo him out of Ranger Stop and Pop. Really? Someone said. And Javi said, yep, that's the plan on some Reddit posts that someone told me about fans are going to go are going to get together and boo him out of the con now i don't know union jack really i don't i don't even know if he's on um on on henry court we could check later but there's another one right so you show these to security. Here's the second one right here. I bought a small <laughs> Wi-Fi speaker for my phone. I would love to play the Hitler video clip, uh, the mocking the gay people clip at Ranger Stop and Pop next week when uh, walking by jail source Rex Stable. Now, here's the thing, guys. I don't think Javi planned on doing any of this and all this other stuff. Um, but this was said in someone else's discord. This is not my discord. You know, how right, I know it's not, it's not my discord because it says main lobby. So this means that the ban on me regarding discord messages were not this. This has nothing to do with me. It goes to show you that that rumor that is completely dispelled because there is no main lobby on my channel. This also okay. hurts my heart a little bit because like this is sort of me like in a and, way exposing uh, like these are friends of mine. Like both of the names that are on this page, these are good friends of mine. Yeah, Union Jack Ranger is not in my is not in my channel. So, <laughs> uh, and Javi is here. Javi is here. He says that's on an overseas court, which I'm not a part of. So the whole idea of me getting banned because something that's on my Discord is complete utter bullshit. All right. And we have none other than the person that they was trying to frame you for the ban, which was Joey Renaud. And I'm happy that you came up and I'm happy you shared this. And now you have pretty much blown the top off this whole Ranger Stop ban because of something that was said on my discord, which it was not. I got banned specifically for speaking out and holding Power Rangers accountable. And now Joey has provided proof. Any last words, Joey? And thank you so much, man. We really appreciate those screenshots. Absolutely. I, that's, I really thought that I thought that I heard that you were banned prior to Ranger Stop. So that's why this is like a big freaking revelation to me. Could be. Could be because I have people in security who was working security and they say, hey, they saw the Discord messages and they banned you because of them. And I'm like, I never said call out ASJ. I don't I don't I look through my outs. I never said out. I never said hurt ASJ, but I was banned allegedly for Discord messages, which shows I'm not even part of. Second, those Discord messages are not even in my channel. Right. That's I, I thought that I thought that the reason why you were banned would have been because you have no issue talking about the harsh reality and truth when it comes to the Ranger Nation. And a lot of people can get very uncomfortable and very defensive and revert back to somewhat childish ways because we're tarnishing their childhood memories. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Well, thank so you. We're all adults now and we need to be you know, adults about and man up, you know. And Joey, we appreciate you. Shout out your socials so people can go. I know you play Mortal Kombat. I, I did do a do little digging in you. And I'm like, this guy doesn't seem like he has smoke with me, you but. Dig, bro. You no, like I don't. Like, so I, I would I your 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 opinions have been very poignant. Um, 
to where I haven't been able to really decide if this, uh, if you like talking about the negative ranger stuff because it's like, you know, draws people in, but it's sort of like what you said earlier, like people, I mean, people are attracted to, um, <laughs> people are attracted to hearing negativity. Like it's like gladiators in the Coliseum, like people would flock to that shit because someone else like, uh oh, let's go see what's going to happen to them. But if okay. it's something good, like nobody really cares. Okay. But all the bad stuff, you know? So it's, I appreciate your point of view. Hey, man, thank you for being forthcoming and sharing that information. Uh, we really appreciate it. And good luck at Ranger Stop. You can come up anytime, man. Anytime you want to talk Power Rangers, you know, I, I hold nothing against you whatsoever. I'm all Joey right? Bernal. I'm on, on Facebook, Instagram, like YouTube. Twitch, like all that groovy stuff. So, all right. Thank yeah. you so much. That was Joey Renaud. Thank you. God damn, boy. <laughs> ah, man. I'm telling you guys. Yes, yes, yes. Someone said it. Um, someone said it. Uh, shout out to Joey, man. Uh, never play poker with that man. Henry is slow roller. He got him comfortable. I had to get him comfortable before we came at him, uh, with the full force. So, uh, that was that was all intentional. I knew about this guy a long time ago, uh, but he was just doing his job. And, you know, if there if someone if someone is stupid enough and not Javi, he, he what Javi said was not of like level threat or anything like that. But if someone is foolish enough to post a threat in Henry Court, you would get banned by me as soon as I see it or, or my mods. But um, it is what it is. Thank you to Joey for basically blowing the top off the whole I got banned for Discord messages that they would not show other people. They wouldn't show other people uh, why I was banned, even though I was listed as a threat to Austin St. John and his weak ass team. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. So we look, we getting some juice today. We getting some real juice out of a Sunday stream. I didn't even plan on streaming. And shout out to Joey just coming up because when they gave me his name, I think I said it on stream, I'm like, well, they told me the person that went to security with the Discord messages or whatever, right? And I was like, I'm not releasing his name because I had no proof it was him. It was just uh, a source. And turns out my fucking sources was right. <laughs> but the, the Discord messages was like, a, it's like a red heron. Like, hey, um, we banned him for stuff on his Discord. That wasn't even my Discord. None of that was said in my Discord. And shout out to Javi for coming through, man. Much love the fucking Javier, uh, holding it down. Much love to everyone who helped me basically break this story. And if you hear, you got the freaking break it live, man. You got the break it live. Uh, salute to you, L-O-M-3-M, uh, yeah, saying big W. Big W's in the goddamn chat because we we did it, guys. We did you it. Dig, bro. You'd like to dig. Remember, if I if I told you on Henry Court, I'm like, look, I'm looking for these messages where they say all out call out call out i'm like i'm not finding any of that shit. i'm not finding it it's not in my discord and i said it i said it in henry court i said it like plenty of times i'm like it's not there i checked myself and i went back like a month i went a month back and i'm like oh man <laughs> love this shit, man like oh man when you when you just crack a story live on air which is what i wanted to do I wanted to crack this story live on there. When I saw he said he wanted to uh, come on the show, I didn't attack him. I didn't say what we wanted to talk about. I just said, oh, cool, man. Come on the show. Give us the interview. Uh, I did get him comfortable. That's just like an interview technique. You know, uh, people, there are several people who knew his name that messaged me instantly when he commented. It's like, why do you want to come on your channel? I'm like, I know. Just relax. Just keep it easy. Just you're watching a master at work. I've interviewed thousands of people. We can get the story out of them. We can get the story out of him. All right. So, but uh, shout out to Joey. He can come on anytime. Still no smoke for Joey uh, for doing his job. And, you know, uh, I never want people not to do their job, especially like if someone was stupid enough to threaten Austin St. John, yeah, my ass would probably be like, look, y'all, <laughs> I'll probably reach out to Austin and be like, look, hey, well, I, I couldn't. I just be like, hey, someone is threatening Austin St. John in my Henry court. <laughs> y'all, if I wasn't blocked, I would. But, I, you know, I don't want nothing bad to happen to him. I really want him to live out the rest of his life as a goddamn felon. Um, so, uh, that, that, that's a truthful statement. <laughs> How can you be a threat to a third 30 black belt? <laughs> I don't fucking know, man. Mm. 
<laughs> oh man, he just wants to seem important, man. Austin St. John uh, wants to be more popular than he is, which it, it just would never be. He's not getting cast in any fucking movies anytime soon. Uh, he'll he'll be in jail probably within the next year. He'll be a fel a registered felon, uh, you know, a a felon uh, probably within the next year. He won't be able to leave the goddamn country to certain places. Is is really fucking game over for him, man. The, the redemption story, that shit's not there, man. It's not there. No one is coming back for the 30, the guy who's been in the, I was on a TV show 30 years ago and I can't get cast in shit to save my life. No one gives two fucks unless you're on fan work. All right, uh, what does Primal One say? That's crazy. Got banned under a Discord that has nothing to do with you, right? <laughs> Shaking my head. <laughs> I'll be your lawyer. Also, what are you planning on covering, man? I look, man, I would, <laughs> I'm not suing nobody. I, I, that's not my game.